Hey guys, so today we are going to learn how to paint fudge. This certain uh, picture was really important to me because it was just a really happy day. I bought this fudge from, um, it was like a, it was a peanut butter chocolate fudge that I bought from the Hallmark store. And right now, the first thing I'm going to do is paint the peanut butter. I like to go for light colors first when I do a painting like this. Painting food is just so much fun. Now we're doing the background. I was sitting in the car at the time, so we're kind of having the bird's eye view or maybe a mouth's eye view. Those are my jeans. So we just want to do base colors. Jeans are just blue. At least my jeans were blue. That's my blue nail dust. Have I had blue fingernails at that time period. And now we're doing the wax paper. The fudge was sitting in a wax paper. And wax paper is just usually, it's, it's just kind of like, it's gray, but it's like doing glass. And why, my camera is going up, up, up. Yes, yeah, gotta pull it back down. So now we're doing the bite marks. I actually bit into the fudge. And bite marks are just done with some darkening in the middle and light on the edges. We're now adding some of the crumbs and some of the chocolate part of the fudge now. And that part, I think it was, it was kind of fun. It's a little bit more fun to paint than the peanut butter. The peanut butter was, it was good though. It had a symbol on top of it, which as you can see, I correct. I had to correct the symbol a few times. It's funny how when you paint something, that part can be the harder parts, to add the little small stuff, because I bit into it. And yeah, so you just want to do some perspective, just, the further up you are, the brighter, the further down you are, the lower and darker. Near my feet, I made a lot darker. And uh, yeah, I'm just putting on some highlights. Jeans were kind of washed out from the uh, camera. And the that's like all of the dark part is the bottom of the car. And that's the car seat. <laughs> Not like a baby car seat, but like what I was sitting on. Just the regular, I was in the passenger seat eating my fudge and I'm gonna add some shadows, some highlights. Wax paper is kind of like just painting glass. You're painting what's underneath it mostly. And we're just adding more stuff. We're about done, close to done, but here I'm about to paint my nail and my hand, which this paint was really funny because it was like, it's just, I love this picture for me. I, I, it was such a fun day that I had to like save it. <laughs> <laughs> and now it's uh now it's a painting. So we're adding some of the highlights. And we're just about almost done. Now to go back to the top and finish off some of the bite marks. And this part I had to do a couple of times with a fine brush. And I gotta cover up where I made a mistake. <laughs> I had to redo it a couple of times. It was, it's funny how that takes the, that took the time. But it was a pretty simple. I don't know what it meant. But yeah, we are just about done. Okay, let's check it out. <laughs> okay, guys. So we are all done the fudge painting. This painting took me about three days, but spaced out between a couple of weeks. On top of here is peanut butter, and down here is chocolate, and that's the paper that I was holding. It was a particularly good memory, and I'm very happy to share it with y'all through the power of paint. Okay, guys. Bye. <laughs>